Welcome to another insightful episode with Upkeep, your reliable partner for all things maintenance and operations. I'm Ryan Chan, the CEO and founder of Upkeep. Today, we're delving into the world of human error in maintenance, understanding its types, causes, and how to manage them effectively. We'll explore how even experienced professionals can make simple mistakes and how these errors can impact the safety and quality of work. Stay tuned to learn how to identify, prevent, and manage these errors to ensure smoother operations. Let's dive into the most common sources of human error in maintenance. These are typically caused by poor training, poor management, poorly written operating or maintenance procedures, and improper work tools. There are three general types of errors we need to be aware of, skill-based, rule-based, and knowledge-based errors. By identifying the type of error, we can pinpoint the potential sources and identify areas for improvement. It's important to note that a majority of failures and accidents in maintenance are caused by some element of human error. In industries like aviation, for example, an estimated 80% of maintenance errors involve human factors. So, understanding each type of error can help us catch them in real-world settings. By spotting these scenarios early on, we can strategize to prevent future incidents. Let's start with skill-based errors. These surprisingly occur most often while doing routine activities. Even repetitive tasks that have been performed many times without issues are still susceptible to this type of error. As workers become more familiar with routine activities, there's a tendency to perform tasks with less conscious attention. It might seem counterintuitive, but experienced workers are in fact more prone to committing skill-based errors than less experienced workers. Next, we have rule-based errors. Maintenance work usually has detailed procedures and instructions to guide technicians as they complete tasks. The rules here are those guidelines set to ensure the safety and quality of the work performed. Rule-based mistakes occur when the misuse or disregard of certain rules results in a negative outcome. This type of error can be further broken down into two subtypes. First, we have the misapplication of a good rule. This error type occurs when a rule is used in an inappropriate situation. It's a good rule, but since it's not relevant to the scenario at hand, an error results. Second, we have the application of a bad rule. This occurs when teams or facilities develop informal rules. Bad habits or cutting corners may get the job done, but when these practices become common, they're often seen as informal rules. If these bad rules turn into routine processes, unwanted consequences will follow. Lastly, we have knowledge-based errors. These usually occur when workers perform tasks for the first time. Mistakes of this nature happen due to insufficient knowledge of the activity at hand. These errors come from trial and error and a lack of procedural knowledge. They are somewhat unavoidable when new people are added or new failures come up. But if repeated over time, they can indicate a breakdown in processes. Now, managing human error in maintenance is crucial. Research shows that more than 50% of equipment fail prematurely after being serviced. While human error is inevitable, the incentive to manage and prevent it as much as possible is huge. To minimize human errors in maintenance, we must first recognize the different error types, then grow aware of their root causes, and finally develop a plan of action to prevent them from happening again. Consider human errors as a specific area for improvement. Investing in proper training, for example, can help reduce human errors significantly. In one study, a training program specifically designed to reduce human error resulted in a 50% reduction in incidents within the first year. This proves that though human error is inevitable to an extent, it is certainly manageable. Thank you for joining us today. We've discussed the types of human errors in maintenance and how to manage them effectively. Remember, understanding these errors and their root causes is the first step towards prevention. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. For further information, visit our website at upkeep.com.